In this video, we'll talk about two ways to stake your secret and receive rewards of about 25% APR. You'll want to make sure you already have a Kepler wallet set up with some secret in it. If staking is a new idea for you, it's an opportunity to lock up a token in exchange for rewards paid in that token. Why? Well, because on a delegated proof of stake network like Secret, delegating and staking Secret actually helps provide security for the network. The network gets support with security when you stake, so you get rewards. That's the idea. In this video, we'll cover two ways to stake and demo both of them. First, there is a traditional staking approach in the Kepler dashboard. This involves a 21 day unlock period for your funds. So we're gonna click on stake here in the Kepler wallet, which will take us to the dashboard for staking. Then we'll select the chain, which is obviously secret network. And now we'll choose a validator. This is important. When selecting a validator you wanna to delegate to, consider these factors. First, decentralization of the network. Staking with smaller validators helps distribute power within the network, even if they might need to take a larger cut than the big validators. Second, consider how actively a validator participates in governance and whether its opinions are in line with your values. Also think about the validator's reliability to keep the node online. Then click on stake. Once you bond to a validator, those funds still belong to you, but remember that it will take 21 days to unbond them. Your rewards will accumulate in the dashboard and you can see that pretty easily to claim them. You could auto compound your staking position or do whatever you like with the newly minted liquid tokens. A second option for staking is somewhat different. If you visit app.shayprotocol.io, where we are here, and check out the derivatives tab, this is the opportunity to mint something called a liquid staking derivative. So take your native secret and essentially stake it right here through this transaction, but we get back a token that is called staked secret. There's two cool things about this. Number one, this token is not locked, it's liquid. You can do DeFi with it. You can provide LP in several pools here on ShadeSwap or do whatever you like with it. Second, this token accumulates rewards. In the transaction that we just did, the secret we originally had has actually been staked within a diverse set of validators and is actually accruing staking rewards. As a result, the market is incentivized to value this token at a higher value relative to secret. And that's evident just taking a look here at at what the ratio between the two tokens look like. So now you know two different options about how to stake and receive rewards on your secret. Continue to do your own research and consider what option is best for you. Thanks for watching. Thanks for learning. Stay secret.